Yeah, he well, little Pop was the one that was with him when he got murdered, right? He's the one that got uh, murdered. Yeah, I but, mean, Quando Rondo was with him when he was murdered. Oh, yeah, but, man. Now, I know what I'm thinking already. But, Shit, a setup. I'm thinking. What I'm saying is, was little Pop was he? He was claiming something. Yeah, he pushing six oh two. Was he? Mm-hmm. Okay. And Rondo said he dropping his flag. Mm. Yep. Y'all remember <laughs> I called this. Some type of exit. Feds ain't got to him already. He working. And he trying to say he not a gang member, so he don't be on that Rico and gang enhancement. Did, did he mention shit? anybody name? Damn, I'm trying to get bumpy ass in here because he was the one who had just seen it and super knowledgeable on it. Did he mention but... anybody's name? In the... Nah. That's all he said? He ain't mentioned nobody's name out here? He ain't mentioned nobody's name. Hey, yo, Phoenix. Hey, Phoenix, they clipped my account. Everybody follow my new Oh, account. my God, bro. Hey, Sleepy, <laughs> MNS Sleepy, follow my new Share the room, oh, MNS. You on the stage. Share the room. I'm looking in the insight. Share the room. Hey, y'all. I'm about to find my earbud real quick. Hey, everybody. Hey, Indigo. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Rondo Rondo says he's dropping his hey, neighborhood hey. prayer flag and says he won't be attending Lil Pop funerals. That he need time to himself. Well, he got one good thing working for him. What's he's that? Signed to, he's signed to a blood. So how was that going to work for him? The NBA ain't going for that shit. That's his money. He'll go to war about that little nigga. Oh, okay. That's what he going to hide under. Man. I'm not jump out of the gang either. He know she want his bag back. Nigga, that nigga. Uh, did so, you listen to that song I had sent you, huh? Yep. Yeah, that's, that's that nigga bread and butter right there. He the one. He got to leave Atlanta, though. Can't stand Atlanta. I'm not jumping out of the gang, either. Ain't no loyalty in this shit. I'm my own man. I laid my flag down. I'm not neighborhood, y'all. Ain't going to ride for a nigga for real. He said, oh, wait. just realized that? They going to whoop his ass for the antics he's doing with the police. Yeah. That's why he's going to run for the DP. Hey, you know what? Yeah, that, that went viral. Mm -hmm. Yep. He's running from that DP. They gonna whoop his you know the homies were. Come on. Huh? Oh, and we see a twin. nigga doing all that to the pro. We whooping his ass. Come to the hood, nigga. Twin, did you see what Chicago, them Chicago yeah, people did? Fucking... They reenacted the whole thing. Yeah, yeah well, he getting a DP a... for that, for it's sure. You a bitch ass nigga. Because it don't take. For sure, that's an ass whooping. Come to the park, nigga. Don't be late. Rocket side just to see what the fuck going on. Everybody already hate me. I ain't tripping on the extreme hate. I'm about to focus on my family. The ones who don't really drop a tear if I die. Man, uh, fuck them niggas. Uh, we here for you. Fuck everybody. Damn, they don't sound like that nigga. Fuck dude. everybody. I'm yeah. here. No, that shit. I Hey, like I want to hear what what Wack is saying. Can we? Can we? Where uh, where Danny at? Right here. Danny, read that shit. You know you're the reader, nigga. <laughs> I didn't read it to myself. <laughs> you know I'm not the reader for the people. I got you. Know, it was like it was still voice. like you know I, I could you understand. And <laughs> you 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 and Abby, y'all voices demand attention. Yeah, I got. I have yeah, to turn my phone up a little bit, or oh, else okay. I would have read it. Happy. Um, Danny, do it. All right, for sure. Quando Rondo says he's dropping his neighborhood crip flag and says he won't be attending Lil Pop funeral. Says he needs time to himself. I'm not. Oh, he illiterate. I'm not jump out gang either. Ain't no loyalty in this shit. I'm on my own. Wait, I'm my own man. I laid my flag down. I'm not neighborhood, y'all. Ain't gonna ride for a nigga for real it's no sense of me being a part of y'all shit y'all fuck with the opposition i don't give a fuck who feel 
hit fuck you and if you can't feel where i'm coming from on this you a bitch ass nigga because it don't take rocket science to see what the fuck going on everybody already hate me i ain't tripping on the extra hate i'm about to focus on my family the ones who gonna drop a tear if i die Ooh, oh lord <laughs> i know <laughs> yo why they type like this <laughs> All right, so fuck everybody. I mean that shit. I fuck with a select few people. My circle's super tight. I fuck with Lil D, Trench, Lil Serial Big Dude, and Lil Tim. It's too much going on. Yo, many fingers pointing to many people talking behind my back. I got too much weight on my shoulders. I'm standing on all 10. I love pop like a... F like as fuck but i'm not going to cuz but i'm not going to cuz funeral i know where me and cuz stand at fuck how anybody feel keep that shit to yourself nobody know what the hell is going what the hell i'm going through i watch my homie die i want to see a lot of y'all wake up and keep a level head after that i'm focusing on myself and my little girl that's who i'm living for all the times i miss with her on top of all this I'm not in a relationship. I'm not tied to no girl. Me and her have a mutual understanding. I'm solo rocking and I mean that shit. Fuck you and whoever feel. Hit my bag up. I don't need no handout. Oh, Lord. Motherfucker's grammar is all fucked up. And that nigga in trouble. So y'all think. <laughs> but y'all felt them. So y'all don't just think that it's like, you know, some type of PTSD, some type of shock that he's going through and not like working with the boys or what? That nigga next. That nigga yeah, himself. he already so feel it. Show. He feel it. He's done. That shit himself. get real for a nigga when you see somebody dying. Yeah. For you. That shit get real. He's yeah, popping hot shit look. though when they kill King Von. Though. He wasn't. Yeah, yeah, yeah I was gonna say six that. Six old yeah. nigga, grown nigga, nigga die every day. I don't give a fuck. Oh, he talking about. Oh, yeah, no then shit. he shoot a music video. I think video. it's just too close to comfort for him. Well, he was like he shaking on. I'm gonna die one day. I just want to make sure my kids straight. If it happens, it happens. I'm ready. If it comes, he was popping. They killed the nigga right. They killed that nigga right in front of dude. Meaning, when they got you the car. They reached over Quando and got rid of dude. Oh. They never even they didn't they they that Quando was not their target. They reached over that nigga, got out on that nigga, and got on. So he watched it. He he really watched the demonstration. Right? So, first violation. He was doing too much hollering with them detectives. Too much. I was like looking at that shit. I'm like, somebody gonna put that nigga in a video when his enemies are clowning about that shit. So if the phone call came to him, cause I really think that 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 killing it fucked with his mind. A lot of these niggas be talking this shit and ain't really been in that shit. That's that's different. When the nigga dropped right in front of you and you know you could have went with him. And then here come the calls. Cause what happened is he went from being what he was wanted to be to who he really wanted to be when the police got there. That nigga went to civilian. All the way civilian. Here come the calls. Hey my nigga, what's up with that? Whoop, 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 whoop. He still over here tripping about this body that just happened. They telling him, <clears throat> pull up. He know what's going on. Pull up. Yeah, you gotta pull up. Damn, these niggas wanna DP me, nigga. And the, this nigga just got killed in front of me. He know he got to explain. Yeah, pull up. Get to so the now what he doing is fuck it. I dropped my flag, but see, even with that, you know that that gotta happen a certain way. It's not that easy just dropping your flag, is it? Right. I was going to say, you can't just say uh -huh. that, my nigga. <laughs> like, but here go the problem. Process. That's what you see when you get a nigga that's in entertainment and y'all, like, get him up under you and fuck it. Y'all say he can claim the hood, right? 
and he really don't understand this shit because he wasn't in this shit the way he's supposed to be before all that get to happening. And he can say it and do this and do that. All right. I don't want you no more. That ain't how I go. So now whoever brought him around, that's their responsibility. Figure it out. Whoever co-signed that, huh? Yeah, you know that. You know this shit for life. So Quando Rondo, he, he started banging after he became like big that's in the music industry? Or? Matter. He started getting his little buzz going and shit like that. And you know, niggas get around him and whoop de whoop and he he like, all right, nigga, this was keeping me safe. This who I'm with every day, there it go. Is there a set in his neighborhood? Yeah, it's it's six soldiers in Atlanta. Like a motherfucker. Yeah, they deep as fuck out here for real. I, wa yeah, I watched I, it I, I watched it get going. Nigga, when it was it was two, three out, nigga, them projects right across the street from that federal penitentiary. It was right there. Call them shits. Uh, fuck his name with them stupid goddamn price. Right across the street, literally. I'm watching right, right across the street from the prison. It's crazy, nigga. Like, nigga, across the street, not the block, nigga, right there. What is the name of the shit over there? Damn. The something. Nigga, I'm yeah. watching niggas, bro. Nigga, back then, I swear, niggas was jumping the gate and going to clubs oh, and being geez. back in prison before the count. I seen that shit. Is it Thomasville Projects? Does oh, that man, ring a bell? You say the name, I'ma know it. It's Both Harry. Seasons. What do you say? Both Camden. Four Seasons. There you go. Four Seasons. That, there you go. That's it. You say the name, I'ma know it. Four Seasons. So you know what I'm talking about. Them shotgun ass, you know, you go in there like shotgun style home, like just straight across. But right across the street, it's the federal penitentiary. So... You know, but again, it's like, y'all hear what I tell these youngsters, what I tell them not to do. Gang bang, gang bang. You said, you said gang banging was, is stupid. It's stupid as fuck. I'm a <laughs> now I'm gonna tell you why. These little niggas, right? They getting into it. I'm rapping, I'm hanging over here. All right. You ain't now if you the little nigga that's coming outside, nigga, you wake up, your brother, your uncle, your sister, your auntie, and nigga, you just this what you grew up in. I understand it. You grew up every day, nigga. Hey, what's up, little nigga? What up, little nigga? Look at little E. What's up, little E, little E? Come over there. Damn, what's happening over there? Oh, they just killed Big D Dog. Damn, man, Big D Dog, man, just gave me twenty dollars and shit. Damn, who killed him? Them niggas whoop to whoop cross over there. Yeah, all right, cool. Go to school. Lil Eden got suspended in the sixth grade. You're suspended for it. Man, I had a fight with such and such because they say my brother is such and such from this set and them, his brother. Yeah, I, I know this was about to happen. But then you got this other nigga start rapping at 19, 20, get around these niggas. He at the studio. They giving him a little weed. The niggas talking about this nigga finna get signed to these niggas and these niggas, these niggas. They put their claws on them. Now they claiming your set. This nigga knows nothing about this shit. Or what come with this shit. He's seeing all the so-called good shit. I got niggas with me. This is that. Six nine. Same shit. When that shit start getting different and weird, what they gonna do? Y'all remember, y'all remember I said this. I hope it don't happen. They gonna intercept some wiretaps on this nigga. Niggas threatening want to do something to him. They're going to let him hear him. And it's going to get jiggy. Life's in the You talking about Quando Rondo? Yeah, oh yeah. Yeah. They're going to intercept some wiretaps today on everybody's phone out there. They're going to get that little nigga. They're going to be like, this nigga knows something. You know he knows something. We're going to let this nigga hear these niggas want to try to try to kill him. Press play. They're going to be like, what you know about this? Your name been mentioned. Of course they is. Uh, Yolanda doing that shit good. You know, and he out there. You know they. Bro, just, that's what I'm telling he next, you. He been in too much publicity not, right I, now with killings. What and about shit. Not, not, nothing against Quan no, though, but I don't. I don't think. Nigga, he better get the fuck out of Atlanta. 
Everybody on stage and in the goo, please share the room one time. Share the room, share the room. My what question is though, what, so, so if, if neighborhood is in Atlanta, you know what I'm saying, could they link it with the with the neighborhood out where you're at? How you think it got well listen, man. That let's just say this without saying too much. Ain't nothing super that's authentic out there, bro. It's authentic out there. That ain't no that ain't no watered down situation. If you do the math for me, I told y'all watch it get started. You should be able to do that math. Who was running with who and then what circles was what back then. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's that's that ain't nigga can't tell me, oh man, this is a ladder. Them niggas ain't nah nah. That shit is authentic like a motherfucker. They one of them hoods that really touched with the yeah. motherland. Yeah, from the A. Who not? Yeah, they got they got Chris. He, he just living up too. there then. Nah, he only living there. He live in Marietta. It's definitely it's definitely sixties out there. In, Man, in Marietta so, is. You know that's a lot. You know, don't call that. <laughs> I, I, yeah, y'all gotta cut this. I mean, I Come know Mariela is Marietta right Atlanta. there. You acting like he's saying something yeah. far away, like Mariela's right Atlanta. there. No, they ain't far. No, I'm saying like who talks with? Nah, cause I'm in Sandy Springs. Springs. No, no, That's just like real 15 Atlanta, minutes. nigga. I get what he's saying, but you know, to the hey, big L, you know, to the world when niggas say it, you know, to the world, like, uh, yeah, Migos. Marietta's Atlanta for sure. Yeah, yeah, like Migos, we gonna say they from Atlanta. You know, y'all gonna say nah, them niggas from North that way, right? That's why they say that. I'm from North that way. That's why they say that. But they going to say, every nigga that's in the game, whether you from here, here, there, they going to say Atlanta. I've never heard another motherfucker say a, one of those little outside cities. Yeah, just like we say we from L.A. when we out of state, but we from the valley. Yeah. No, I don't say like I tell a nigga, I don't say that. <laughs> I say I'm from LA. I don't. I don't. We said we are from LA County, so fuck so it. So you don't got They don't know the valley. Hella extra. We definitely from LA County. I'm from Ohio. When I think of Cali, they don't know what the way is. Southern Cali. Before I, uh, I'm from Charlotte, North Carolina. Hey, who from hey, Ohio? Hey, Wack. I'm from Atlanta. I'm from San Bernardino, yeah. California. Hey. Wack, what you up? don't think Quando Rondo showed his true colors when he gave that interview with uh, Angela Yee? That nigga sound like on that interview here too. If the pressure got on, I don't is that CL? Who is that? Yeah, that's a lot of your body dudes. experience. Yeah, a lot of these dudes is. Uh, I tell y'all, man, and this why I don't be mad at them, bro. <clears throat> let me tell you something, Reek. Reek, when he was coming around me out down there, Reek can't do no gang shit around me, man. That's out. Wack, you was right. He was right, what? Something finna go on. Ain't <laughs> something finna go it's on. I'm gonna, the I'm gonna tell the homies. I'm gonna tell the homies. Hey, tell Reed get up out of him. Off the rip. <laughs> on Paru. Hey, blood, tell Reed get up out of him. Paru, that's all. What's up? What's up? Hey, my nigga, get up out of him. What's well, shit? Shit. Homie, get up out of him. Nigga. He gonna say, Let's oh, God. Let's paint the picture. Dude got a bunch of tattoos. He's 33 years old. His mentality ain't that. And this shit happened. Hey man, yeah, we got you. Yeah, man. You a gang member, huh? Yeah, okay. So shit, you can spy. Well, we got this 20, man. It's two or three niggas over here fucked up, man. What you mean that wasn't you? Yeah, word is it was you, nigga. Whack all them told us it was you, nigga. What? He come to an experience. Nah, that wasn't me. So Whack was there. Yeah, he was there. There you go. Now ain't even put him at the spot. Here it come. All right, so it wasn't you. Are you saying it was Whack? I mean, it was other people there, too. Damn. Man, look, nah, we're going to go on with Whack. Whack and the other two niggas. Was it two or three niggas? Nah, it was three. Talking to the officer. Nigga, you lying like a motherfucker. Whack and them three already gave us his name. Take him to the back and book him. Take him to the back. If it's summertime, they put the heat on. If it's wintertime, they turn the AC up. Hey, you in there. They leave him in there about an hour, hour and a half. 
come back. Hey, uh, you want to talk to the detective? Yeah, shit. They for they doing they signed statements on you right now. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, listen, man, it was whack. Three homies, whoop to whoop to whoop, nigga, whoop to whoop to whoop. One just got out the pen. They dry this, dry this, dry that. All right. When they get me and the homies, I got to ride the whole beef and cut my homies loose. You know why? I'm the nigga got this nigga around. No, they got out the pen. They, he ain't got a whole nother agency involved. Now he got. That's real bro, shit. I'm listen, and I'm going to tell you, I would not be saying, oh, reeks this, reeks that. You know what I be saying? Get. Guess who I be calling the stupid motherfucker? Phoenix, who would I be calling the stupid Myself. You yourself. for doing the shit? Hey, man, I just, because we know better. The homie be on paperwork, they, they, that, that gonna get the marshals yeah. involved. You know, they look I'll hard. I will be calling myself, and this is what I'm saying. These niggas talk. Oh, it's the homie, the homie a rod. What you mean he a rod? What, what, what makes you? Nah, nah, you know, he stayed with his burner. Nah, he stayed with his burner. All right, well, what makes him a rider? Homie, he tatted up. or oh, he tatted up, stay with a burner. All right, well, what makes him a rider? See, what y'all definition of what that is and mine is two totally different things. Nigga that been up under that light a couple of times. Nigga that showed the proof. Nigga that went in there probably did some time he wasn't supposed to have to do and did it for the time he had to do. Went in there and didn't get no roll up. He didn't call his whole time. He didn't came back home, got to it. Might have repeat. I don't want you to repeat it, but we talking about back in them days when we called that. Oh man, whoop to whoop them got away, but shit, you know they went and got the homie. Why? Shit, it was his car. He wasn't even in the motherfucker. He tell him who really had his car. He ain't told him shit. He took a deal for five. Paul Rue, I get the homie a package, right? This is what it is. So at the end of the day, when niggas and got decorated with real shit, maybe some real dumb shit, then we established, you know, homie's a rider. And even that dude, that individual, after so many trips and so many beatings and so much shit, even when he get to a certain age, it might change. That's a fact. It's just the reality of it. I be like, damn, I'm the only one tired. Like, these streets. Niggas want to act like this shit ain't what it is. Your most dedicated youngster is a nigga that come into this game young, 12, 13. And he didn't been to what he went through. His dedicated years is like 16 to about 26. Them years, that nigga that come up in this shit, took his licks with him four, and you 16 to 26, you got action at that nigga staying down. When that same motherfucker get hit that 30 mark, and he already did about 12 of his life back behind the walls, and he didn't see homies and toll on him, and this nigga done fucked his bitch when he was gone. And this happened and this happened. And they broke in his spot in two days he was in jail and all this shit. And that light get over him. But something he didn't do, something he did, he gonna ride it. He gonna start thinking about where Auntie Mabel lives in Backwoods, Alabama. For real. Where he can go hide and go sit. That's it. Niggas say, well, I take this fucking 18 nigga with 80. Nigga, I'm 30, I'm 45. Kids all be grown. These niggas, I ain't even do this shit. This nigga, the next whole tank, he ain't saying nothing. He gonna let me take the fall. Or can I go down there with Auntie Sarah to Alabama and give me a motherfucking job at Walmart, nigga, and let people call me Kevin? Or do I go to the end where I might not make it out and through this stressful ass time, you know, I'm, I'm down for the hood, but the hood ain't gonna do nothing for me. And hope and beg, I get a 30 cent an hour job, a $30 a month pay number. Shit. Large percentage of them niggas these days, then they gonna go to thinking about this. But Big K Dog and Big D Dog and Maniac and Evil One and the homie Popeye and Lil JoJo, all them niggas told, ain't nobody did nothing to them niggas. Shit, I could just hit them niggas up and holler at them niggas and shit. We might get all fuck with each other. And them niggas is killers. And I know I'm with the shit. I do I keep it gangster go do the 15 off the 18 with 80. Big decision too. Remember this when you that's, that's that's big decisions right there. Real.
college like okay you going to college oh shit you went to you went from county to college oh shit hell yeah he used to call it that college i'm going to college and now that shit's just like the fuck but that was what was expected back in the day we had to go to college we didn't take our steps we, yeah. college college yeah, was prison gg down in the go hey gg was down in the go i was trying to holler at her but you was talking what but, you I don't know. I guess she was working, but I need to holler at her when she get off hey, work. I just got a text. <laughs> I just got a text, and, and I don't know. Was you in Cloud Monsters? I wasn't in there. I, I, I'm right. trying to. I heard that um some shit went down, and um yeah, <laughs> the same shit exactly. Same shit. I was yeah, you know yeah. That? It's all yeah. That's different, right? There. I just and my thing.